NearlyDanish.com. Five, four, three, two, one. Uh, let's get ready to run. Okay, so today we're focusing on current affairs, political parties and their leaders. All right, for the people that are here for the first time that don't know about the YouTube channel, we have a YouTube channel, all the sessions are recorded and posted on the channel just in case you miss a session, you can catch up on the channel. It's called Nearly Danish TV. Um, just go to YouTube and search for it. Subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss anything. Um, look under playlists. You will see the playlist for summer 2024 for Melbourne Escape's phone and the playlist for summer 2024 for Infosat's phone. So these are all the videos. These are videos of all the practice sessions that we've had so far. So in case you miss it, you can go catch up. Um, all right, moving on. Like I said, today we're focusing on current affairs. It's going to be a short and sweet session. It's Easter holidays. Don't want to keep you guys here for too long. On to the next one. You guys know the answer to this. Right, two people didn't know that Meta Fredrickson is the leader of the Social Democratic Party. She is also the Prime Minister. However, 104 of you got this right, so round of applause. For the two people. Now you know what you don't know. It will appear on your profile. Fix it when you see it. All right, we've got Addy Claudio. Taliva, Yensland, Liesel, and Sumo. Next one. Right. So Trolls Lund Paulson is the current leader of Venstra. He became the leader last year, at the end of last year, when Jakob Elman Jensen decided to quit politics for good. Um, 76 people got this right. 31 people got this wrong. Actually, that's a lot. And by the way, he showed up in the test under current affairs for November 2023. And uh, we did manage to catch him that time. All right, next one. Someone is asking for the pin code. I will be posting it in the group. There you go. Moving on. All right, so it's a complete reshuffle of the top five. We have Liesl, Borgia, Saha, Di, and Alex C. Next one. Pierre Alcindor is uh, the leader of the Socialist People's Party. For the people that got this wrong, now you know what you don't know. Fix that. It will be showing up on your profile later on. Amin is the highest climber up, up three places. Whoever is asking for the Kahoot code, just look up. I just posted it. Um, Amin has the highest answer streak of three. Oh my! He's on fire! Next one. All right, 
Someone just said, thanks for putting the picture. It makes it easier to remember. However, remember that uh, in the test, there are no pictures. So you're going to have to remember their names and the parties that they're affiliated to. Um, Martin Lilgo is um, the leader of Adikil Venstra. 74 of you knew this and 35 of you did not. Now you know what you don't know. Um, the purpose of these cahoots is for you to come here and make the mistake so you don't have to make the mistake in the test. Come here, make your mistakes. Don't be afraid to make a mistake. Okay? If you don't know, guess. If you guess wrong, the correct answer will show on the screen so you get instant feedback. And when you get this wrong, it will also show up on your profile and you can correct it there. And there also will be a quiz about this that you have to do five times. So there's more than enough opportunity for you to correct all your errors and have this information embedded in your brain until the test. Moving on to the next one. We've got DI, Yenzeman, RRS, Dangol, and Octopus. 48 players have hit an answer streak of four. Excellent. Next one. Right, so Mona Yu replaced Son Pape Paulson and the Conservative People's Party. Son Pape Paulson just died, I think it was either this month, early this month or last month, can't remember. And um, he used to be the leader of the, the, the Conservative People's Party. Um, I am almost 90 something percent sure that he will show up on the test under the theme of famous dead people. He was a very famous uh, Danish politician, actually one of the most well-known. Okay, 49 people got this wrong. Now you know what you don't know. Fix that when it shows up on your profile. All right, next one. Actually, surprised a lot of you got this wrong. Um, yeah, so Morton Messerschmidt is the leader for Dansk Folk Party. He showed up in one of the tests, I think, in 22, if I'm not mistaken, 22 or 23. Um, I don't think he's going to show up next time, but I mean, you never know, man. How many people got this wrong? This is 46, 50 people, almost half of you got this wrong. Well, now you know what you don't know. Fix the knowledge gap. Next one. All right. We have Octopus, Yenzeman, RRS, Borja, and Len Pang. This top five is very dynamic, which is actually quite nice. Um, to see a lot of people have knowledge gaps. Uh, this is an opportunity to figure out what, what knowledge gap you have and fix it later. This was a combo breaker. Seven players dropped their answer streak of five. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Next one. All right, Liberal Alliance. Uh, this guy is becoming more and more popular. Um, he, uh, I think, what's the name of that lady? The former leader of um, New Borley left her party and joined his party. So Liberal Alliance. All right, so 38 people got this wrong. On to the next one. All 
All right, round of applause. Yes, Penilla Vermond. Um, yeah, so most of you knew this, 14 people got it wrong. Now you know what you don't know. Phil, fix that no learn the fix that knowledge gap when it shows up on your profile templates. Just hit the answer streak of three. Great job. Almost halfway through. Like I said, today's gonna be a short session. Everybody knows this lady, she's super popular. Let's see if you guys actually know her. What party she was in. All right, so actually, most of you know this. And the Stoibia is the leader of Denmark's Demokratina, and she used to be Ulenning's minister. She got convicted in Visat and created this party, came right back into politics again. She is currently in parliament. And I think someone from Venstra left Venstra and joined her party, and that way the government lost its majority. Okay, so we have a static top five for the first time. Static top five. All right, 23 players reached an answer streak of nine. That's a perfect score. Perfect score. Okay, we've got 16 questions to go. Let's get this done. You know this. All right, so Lars Luka is the leader of Modratana. Um, he created the party, got elected into Bokating for the first time in the last parliament elections. 22 people got this wrong. The rest of you got this right. Fix that knowledge gap. Dangle is back in the top five. This was a combo breaker for four players. Sorry, guys. Next one. All right, so New Bali, um, like I said, Penela Vermund, she used to be the leader of this party. She left and went to Liberal Alliance. And this guy, Frederick Meyer Johansson, took over as the functioning leader. Don't know how long he's going to last there, but at least for now, he's the functioning leader. 22 people got this wrong. Now you know what you don't know. All right, Yenzeman fell out, Borgia, Len Pang, Dangle, and Bold Meerkat 72 moved all up. Three players hit an answer streak of three. Excellent. We are at the halfway point right now. So these are the same questions, just asked the other way around. So hopefully you do better in this second half than in the first half. All right, round of applause. <laughs> Static top five. Static top five. Next one. Like I said, these are the same questions, but ask the other way around. All right, you guys are doing better already. Round of applause. <laughs> SRA is making a comeback with three in a row. Oh my, he's on fire! Next one.
All right, you guys are doing really well. Okay, I can already see a very marked improvement in um, the answers now. So, well done. Great job. Next one. Static top five still. Static top five. 14 players hit an answer streak of four. Excellent. Next one. All right, 24 people got this wrong. Just a little bit of a pause in the middle. So for the, for the new guys, when this is done, how do you find your profile? You go to nearlydanish.com. On there, you'll see this purple thing that says Kahoot. You click here on players, and you will see a leaderboard. It says, find your name below and click on it to see your progress. So for instance, if your name is Treyan, you search, so control F, search here. Boom, click on that. And you will have your profile, and you see all the work that you need to do. It asks you, how prepared are you? So when you're practicing here, it tracks everything. And by the way, I just updated the current affairs. Um, political parties and the government is now in there as well as some new stuff. All right, moving on. Someone is asking, what is the meaning of up arrow or down arrow? That's a good question. I'll show you. Um, so the leaderboard. This guy was below, but I think I'll show you better in the news feed. So when you click on the news feed, you can see it says DRN overtook Biz and moved to rank 12. So DRN used to be at rank 13 and Biz was at rank 12, but DRN has been practicing and accumulating points and accumulated enough points to overtake Biz. And he, he did, I don't know if it's a guy or a girl, but they did. And now they are at rank 12. So now you can see DRN moved up and Biz moved down. All right, I hope that answered your question. Moving on, next one. RRS is back with an answer streak of three. Oh my, he's on fire! Next one. It's almost perfect score, man. <laughs> Static top five. Static top five. Rusin is the highest climber up four places. Great job. Next one. All right, you guys are doing really well. Excellent. Next one. Static top five templates reached an answer streak of six. We're almost at the end now. Okay, so actually this is better than before. So well done. For the 16 people who got it wrong, you can fix it later. Gold Meerkat moving up the ranks. Dango fell to number five. Some players just hit the last streak of 14.
I think you'll all get this one right. Fifteen people got this wrong. It's Francisco Rosenkiel. Uh, Fifteen people got this wrong. Well, next one. All right. Bit of a top five reshuffle. Dan Gall is now on the podium at number three. Lempang, number two. Octopus holding number one. Bullnick at four. And Borja fell all the way to five. Berchik is making a comeback with three in a row. Oh, my! He's on fire! We've got six questions to go. Inga Stoibia. Uh, four people got this wrong. Now you know what you don't know. Static top five. Static top five. Next one. Everyone should get this right. Hopefully. Almost. Okay. <laughs> Two people got it wrong. Now you know what you don't know. Borja fell out. Jens Mann is back in. Julia's back with an answer streak of three. She's on fire. <laughs> Next one. We just talked about this, but um, 17 of you got this wrong. Fix it later. Borja back in the top five. OJMK is the highest climber up five places. Excellent. Three questions to go. Uh oh. Right. I knew this was going to be a weak spot. Son Gal is um, formatting for Falkating. Well, now you know what you don't know. Now you know what you don't know. This was definitely a combo breaker. All right. So top five reshuffled. Lampang number one, Bold Meerkat number two. Borger at three, Yesman four, and Dangle fell to five. Everyone else fell out of the top five. Three players just hit an answer streak of 12. Great job. Next one. All right, so the Social Democratic Party is the biggest in Parliament at the moment. Paul has a streak with 24 correct answers in a row. That's a perfect score. Perfect score. And he's on fire. Oh my! He's on fire! All right, last question. <laughs> this was a disaster, eh? Damn. Oh, my.
almost half of you got this wrong. Okay, I've been saying this for a long time. Make a list of all the political parties in parliament, the year that they were created, their leader. Okay, and also the year that they were voted in, the first time they were voted into parliament, because all that information is relevant. I can see you guys haven't done that. And that's why these numbers are looking like this. So please do it so that you don't end up in a mess because actually this is a very frequently asked question. Okay, enough of the scolding, let's move on to the podium. Fabricio, <laughs> all right, Yenza man is number three, Borja number two, and was it Lan Pan? Bold Meerkats, oh my God. Fabricio is number four and Mary is number five. Wow. Newlydanish.com.